Traditional beam trawling and pulse trawling are two different techniques to catch sole. In the conventional beam trawl fisheries, tickler chains chase sole from the seabed. Pulse fishing uses electrical instead of mechanical stimulation. Pulse trawls are more selective in catching sole and catch less place and other fish per hour. They also catch fewer undersized fish, benthos and debris, and can contribute to a reduction in the discarding. Because pulse trawls are towed at a lower speed, the total fished area to catch the sole quota is lower, as well as the amount of CO2 emission. Pulse trawls are relatively light and penetrate less deep into the sediment, which causes less mechanical impact on the structure of the seafloor, the benthos and the functioning of the benthic ecosystem. No adverse effects of the exposure to electrical pulses have been found. The catch itself is of higher quality due to reduced damage in the net. Pulse-induced injuries are confined to cod retained in the net and small cod passing through the net. The effect on the population will be negligible because only a very small proportion of the cod population is exposed to the pulse. Pulse-induced injuries in other fish species is very low. The increase in pulse fishing led to competition with other fisheries that complained about declining catch rates and loss of fishing opportunities on local fishing grounds. In conclusion, pulse trawling is more efficient to catch sole and the sole quota can be harvested at lower cost and lower seafloor disturbance, bycatch and CO2 emission. Adverse effects of electricity are limited to injuries in cod with negligible effect on the population.